Hey guys, how's it going? Hectic Arsenal here, back with another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video. And today, this is kind of a little bit different video, but um, I'm going to show you some cool little Easter eggs that not I myself found, my little brother found when I was off um, doing some stuff earlier today. Came back and he showed me this pretty cool looking Easter eggs, two Easter eggs that he found on some multiplayer maps online. Um, so I'm going to show you in a local, it doesn't matter if you're online or offline, these easter eggs will show up either way. So let's go into a multiplayer map and the first easter egg that I'm going to show you is on, I can't quite remember the map, what's the map called? It's, I know when I see it, Fringe. Um, it's a pretty, I think it's an okay easter egg, the next one I'm going to show you is probably way better than this. But uh, I'll show you in just a sh in just a sec. Okay, so obviously the first thing you want to do is obviously spawn in with a gun. The ideal gun that I sh probably should recommend is probably either a sniper rifle. It doesn't matter which sniper rifle you have. Obviously, you just need a sniper rifle. Um, and then you come into this area over here. If you spawn over here, you'll probably know where it is. And if you spawn over there, anyway, it doesn't matter. It's in this barn here the automotive barn you just come straight into here and then from where I spawn you obviously turn left and then you see this West Auto Repair sign so what you want to do is go straight next to it and then you could obviously see it through here but you could see the Call of Duty the old Call of Duty Treyarch games uh, here in the background it was pretty hard to see but what apparently my brother did is that he was randomly playing an online multiplayer match and some random dude just came up here with a sniper rifle zoomed in and saw this I think this is pretty cool that Treyarch did this this whole little Call of Duty uh, wallpaper art here uh, with the whole Black Ops War at War and Call of Duty 3 and um, to be honest my favorite Call of Duty out there is probably either War at War or Black Ops mostly Black Ops 2 because of the whole uh, zombie map Origin which was a lot of fun and uh, Mob of the Dead which is pretty cool so the next uh, Easter egg I'm going to show you is on the map Metro and I'm just going to put it up uh, in just a sec Okay, so we're here on Metro, and uh, I'm just going to wait for this uh, whole Match Begins time limit to go down. Five, four, yada yada, hurry up please, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Okay, here we go. So we spawned here in the Black Ops spawn here. So what you want to do is go to the bar, which is near the CDU, uh, the other team spawn. It's right here and this one is probably I think I already said it but this one's probably one of my favorites and it's also kind of typical and it's a lot harder to see because you don't really see it as much because you're mostly focused on the um, the whole multiplayer map itself but over here you go to the bar and <laughs> this is pretty cool uh, you have all of the zombie perks in here which is freaking awesome but um, you could probably tell if you pause the video or actually do this yourself, you will find that there's no PhD, which is kind of typical of Treyarch seeing is that they wouldn't put in PhD, except for the Call of Duty Black Ops 2 map, so it's kind of cool. You see there, Juggernaut, Stamina, Quick Revive, Tombstone, Deadshot, and I believe that's Mule Kick, and I think that's about it, yeah. So um, it's pretty cool that they did this and um, yeah, I kind of enjoyed doing this video for you guys. So let me know down in the comments right below um, if you found any um, interesting multiplayer easter eggs on the map. And um, let me know what, um, what else you want to see on this map. <laughs> I just realized now that, that that's also here again as well. You get a better look at this. Um, I'm also thinking about doing a Zombies the Giant walkthrough, like yeah there's probably tons of uh, the Giant walkthroughs out there but um, in hype for the D D Eisendrak because I have the season pass and I'm obviously going to get it two weeks earlier but I don't know but um, let me know. So anyway if you guys enjoyed the video please leave a like and a comment down below, hopefully subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.